Hello everyone and welcome back to this channel. My name is Nima and in this video I'm going to show you how to connect your microphone with XLR cable to uh, Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 or any other Focusrite Scarlett products. Um, it's easy but you have to be very very careful because if you make a mistake you can um, destroy your microphone, your headphone, uh, the computer that is connected and also the Focusrite Scarlett itself. So let's begin. As always we have to connect a, a Focusrite Scarlett to your PC, your laptop, your computer to turn it on. Well, as you can see, there is a input for line or XLR, there is a volume or gain, and this is the button that I forgot to turn off last time I used Focusrite. It's not dangerous, but it was good if I could remember to turn it off. Anyway, I turn it off now. And as you can see, there is another button which is called Air. This is what we need now, but most importantly, let me fix the camera. This bottom here, uh, 48V, which is called Phantom Power. This is the power because the microphone itself doesn't have any power. So if you connect it to the focus right, it doesn't do anything at all but you have to be very careful about that you need to remember every single time that you must connect your cable XLR cable to Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 then push this button and when you are done with your recording you have to turn it off and then um, disconnect the cable from Focusrite Scarlett 2i2. Otherwise, as mentioned, you can destroy your microphone, your headphones, and Focusrite itself, because all of these things are connected. So right now I'm going to show you how you connect your microphone, and then we we will hear the difference between a uh, Blue Yeti microphone that I use now for voiceover and Rode NT1A. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now I can hear myself, and I believe you can hear me now. And that's the difference between Rode NT1A and Blue Yeti uh, podcast microphone and uh, microphone that you usually use for recording your vocals. I already have some experience with it. Uh, it's warmer and it just take your 
vocal, your sound when you standing right in front of the microphone. Right now you cannot see me, but if I go away a little bit, then you're not able to hear me. Or maybe you hear me very, very low. So I have to stay right in front of the microphone. So I hope you enjoy watching this uh, video. Please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel and share this video with your friends. At the end of this video, I'm going to show you how to disconnect your XLR cable in a safe mode. See you next time.